When it comes to losing body fat, there is no one size fits all solution. And while it's important to pace yourself and be patient because getting very lean does take time, there are also situations where you can speed things up and lose body fat faster. And that's why in this video, I'm gonna share with you three very efficient ways to do exactly that. Because a lot of people out there, including myself, prefer to lose body fat faster initially and then leverage that momentum to move into something more sustainable later on. With all that said, let's dive into strategy number one that will help you lose fat faster, which is setting a dedicated protein day. What I mean by this is that you're gonna pick one day of the week where you're gonna be eating nothing but lean protein and green leafy vegetables until you're no longer hungry. And your carbs and your fats will be kept at a bare minimum, which means no starches, no cooking oils, no fatty foods, no fatty protein sources either. You're just focusing on those lean protein sources. Examples of those would be low fat cottage cheese, liquid egg whites, lean chicken breast, lean turkey breast. And the benefit of these foods for a day like this is they're very, very filling in low calorie density. I've seen people eat 1200 calories a day or even a thousand calories a day and they're full and they're okay. So just one day like this per week will allow you to create that much bigger calorie deficit, which means that you're gonna be losing body fat much faster. And you're gonna do that without feeling that extra hunger. Now, my recommendation is to place your protein day on the busiest day of the week where time is gonna fly by, you won't even notice it, but you will get that extra fat loss. I've also personally used the protein day as a simple heuristic for when I'm traveling. If I don't have great food options available, I'll just pick apart what I have, I'm just gonna eat the protein, keep things simple, and I know that I'm not going to overeat. So if you find yourself in a situation where it's not an ideal place to track or you wanna take a mental break from tracking, well, consider just making it a protein day because it's gonna keep the diet very simple and allow you to get that bit of an extra fat loss. Now, the second strategy that can make you much more efficient at losing body fat is something called phasic dieting. With this strategy, you pick a period of four to six weeks where you go with an aggressive calorie deficit to maximize fat loss, and then you follow that up with a period of maintenance calories for about one to two weeks. And when you mentally know that you're committing to a four week period of time, you can really dedicate yourself 100% instead of dabbling around like most people do when it comes to fat loss. And in that four week period, you're focusing on keeping calories low, protein high, you're doing your resistance training regularly, you're sleeping seven, eight hours, you're making sure you're getting your step count, you're cleaning up your food environment, removing all the foods that cause you to overeat and have cravings, you're hitting the like button below, you're making sure you're tracking everything 100% to hold yourself accountable, you're removing alcohol, you're really dialing yourself in to have that maximum efficiency. And in a phase like this, when done properly, you can be dropping anywhere between one to one and a quarter percent of your body weight per week. So if you're 200 pounds, around 90 kilos, well, that's two to two and a half pounds per week, around one kilo of body fat loss every week. And that's a really good number. So over the course of an entire block of four weeks, well, you can drop eight to 10 pounds around four, four and a half kilos. Really nice progress. And the benefit of doing it like this is because you can time these phases with life events and when there's a window of opportunity. So let's say right now you just finished a project at work and you know there's not gonna be another one for six weeks. Well, that's a great opportunity to dial yourself in over the course of the next four weeks and then take that two week maintenance. So it really gives you that flexibility to do the fat loss when it best fits your lifestyle. And the other benefit here is that you get to practice maintenance. After each one of those phases, now you're learning how to stay at that new baseline weight, which is a very valuable skill. A lot of people can lose the body fat in the short term, but very few people can keep the body fat off over the long term. Now, the third strategy that you can do to lose body fat faster is something I call leveraging the weekends. For most people, weekends are the enemy when dieting. Monday to Friday, they're okay, they're making some good progress, they have their structure, but then the weekend comes around and overeating, overindulging, basically destroys all that progress and have to restart again on Monday. But what if we could leverage the weekend to improve fat loss and actually make it more enjoyable? Well, my recommendation is to pick fun physical activities that you can place in the weekends because that's when most people have more time and more control over their schedule. And as a natural consequence of these activities, you will be more active and you will be losing more body fat. And these are activities that you enjoy and they're not linked to dieting. You will do them whether you're dieting or not. 
And these can be things like joining a walking group, maybe going for a hike with your friends, uh, walking your dog or walking other people's dogs, can be taking on new hobbies like dancing or some group classes. And there are activities that make life more fun, make the routine much more enjoyable because a lot of people are so rigid in their routine Monday to Friday that they don't even have anything that they're looking forward to. And often a difference between a healthy and unhealthy lifestyle is exactly what's happening in the weekends. Adding fun physical activities into your schedule is critical for improving mental health, for reducing stressing and emotional eating and stress in general. While you're engaged and having fun physically, your mind is resting. Just sitting down all day and thinking about life problems and all the foods you can't have isn't just gonna get you off track with your diet it's gonna get you off track with life in general. And at the end of the day, this isn't just about losing some body fat. It's about creating a healthy, active lifestyle you enjoy, and naturally, a lifestyle that will lead you to get leaner and stay leaner. And what's gonna help you with that is making sure you hit that subscribe button below, enable notifications by hitting the bell icon, details for coaching if you wanna work with me are in the description below. Also leaving another important video here for you at the end, check out that video, and I'm gonna see you right there.